More AI news stories that you might have missed. First up, Qualcomm is jumping in with new AI chips. Qualcomm, if you didn't know, are the people behind a lot of the chips in your top Android phones. Uh, they recently branched out into some Snapdragon PCs with the Snapdragon X processors uh, that Microsoft co-developed, and now they are actually jumping in and they announced two brand new AI chips. Uh, those are supposed to be released sometime in 2026. So that means that every major chip foundry and manufacturer in the world has now announced AI chips. And we're going to see a huge amount of competition on these. And it's not going to be just NVIDIA leading the world on this. We're about to go to war but in the most unique way possible. Both the United States and the People's Liberation Army of China are using AI in not just intelligence as far as spying and information gathering, but in war tactics. How to the term the Chinese army is using is intelligentized war operations. They're basically taking what they've been doing, making it smarter, making those decisions faster. Um, and that's actually a really kind of a terrifying use of AI. It makes sense because they have massive amounts of data and AI does a fantastic job of crunching that information rapidly. But to be using that in war seems a little bit scary to me. What do you think? These are just a couple simple AI stories today. If you stay tuned, we're going to have more tomorrow.